What's up guys, it's your boy Goblins, and today we're talking about some Destiny stuff. So I don't know if you guys have heard this or not, but in the next update for Destiny, they're bringing back some year one exotics, son. And when I say bringing back, they're actually making these level 20 exotics available at level 40 as well, which is super dope. Um, I'm super stoked on this. I know there's been a couple people that have already talked about it, but I wanted to kind of wait a couple days or so till... So just to see that, it, you know, Bungie would stop letting us know that these year one exotics would be coming out. They kept posting more and more pictures on their Instagram, and I just figured, you know what, I'm just going to hold off my video until they're done posting these pictures so I can really see what's, uh, what's going down for level 40 and what they're going to be uh, upgrading until year two. And personally, I just want to go back over these and tell you how hype I am for this. Okay, so the first thing I want to talk about are Radiant Dance Machines Might a Multi Tool. Oh, shit! You guys knew I would obviously talk about this. This is my this is my favorite combo right here. The RDM and the Mita Multi Tool. Oh man, you don't even know how much fun running around with that shit is. It's my it is literally my favorite loadout. If you guys search up my my legend on my hunter, all you will see is Mita Multi Tool and Radiant Dance Machines. That is my jam. So I'm super stoked that that loadout's coming back. And now that Scout Rifles are kind of beefed up from our last patch prior to all this, it's it's like. Yeah, this this is gonna fucking this is gonna work, you know? Yeah. Next up, the armamentarium's coming back for Titans, and that's huge as well. Having that double grenade, as I said before, is huge. Double sticky nades for days. That's what I'm all about right there. So when I play my Titan, armamentarium's gonna be my jam. Dragon's Breath's also making a comeback, which is actually pretty cool. I like I like that kind of because it's kind of like a kind of like a replacement Galahorn. Doesn't exactly replace Galahorn. Has more unique effects to it, essentially. And uh, I like the look of the Dragon's Breath. I really like that that rock launcher as a whole anyway. So, yeah. Plan C is coming back. I don't really care. All I know is that it's a really good uh, fusion rifle. But it's really not my jam. Super good advice. Yeah. ATS-8 Tarantula Hunter Exotic Chess Piece is going to be making its uh, debut in this upcoming patch. Which is pretty cool as well. A couple of people have somehow actually gotten that chess piece so far. It's somehow glitched into their inventories, but that's how they got it. So, Peregrine Greaves, the Transformer Boots. Yeah! Year two, here we come. I actually like Peregrine Greaves, especially in PvE. Those things are sweet. Apothesis Veal for Warlocks. Probably the, one of the coolest looking helmets for Warlocks is making a year two debut. No Land Beyond for year two. Very interesting choice. Why, you might ask? I really don't know. That's a good question. I think it's the fact that it is an exotic sniper rifle, um, it's a primary slot sniper, sniper rifle. Some people really like it, some people are really, really talented with that gun. Um, otherwise, that's re not really my jam, but it's pretty cool that they're bringing it back to year two. Acleophage Symbiote, which is pretty cool as well. That's a great, that's a great helmet for all hunters that are running gunslingers. The Twilight Garrison's also making a debut for Titans in uh, year two. So once again, some people have somehow gotten their hands on it already, but it's actually really cool seeing more exotics coming to year two. Um, we've only got a couple so far, but it's still, still that extra little bit of something, you know? Hard Light making a year two debut. Damn, son. Oh, I'm pretty stoked for that, actually. I, I really like the Hard Light for what it is. The Bones of Yao. Oh, man. So when you're playing the raid now, you don't just have to like flip on those those level 20 boots and try and jump around during the puzzles and whatnot. You could fucking just wear the level 40 ones. Yeah. I, once again, let me tell you something. I love, I love hunter boots. They're amazing. Bones of Yao with control jump on Blade Dancer with the last word, game over. You're going to get wrecked. Radiant Dance Machines, Mita Multi Tool Combo. Once again, you're going to get wrecked, son. Yeah. Those are my, like, two favorite loadouts. I'm actually really... I'm, <laughs> I'm fucking stoked, man. I'm stoked these are coming out again. A couple other interesting things that are dropping for you, too. In this upcoming patch, in the December patch, is uh, the referral program, which we'll talk about later. And they're gonna make it so you can get these new exotics and exotic engrams for level 40. So that's that's pretty helpful as well. They also apparently fixed up the Crucible drop rates a little bit as well, making it so that more stuff will drop when you're playing Crucible and Iron Banner and all that good stuff. So, as I always say, get hype! Yeah! Nice to see that they're going to be breathing in a little bit more life into Destiny again. I'm super stoked on that. I, you know, I, I miss Destiny. It's been nice taking a break from it and playing some Fallout 4 and uploading some Fallout 4 stuff. It's just been a nice little break. And there's a couple other patch notes, but we'll go over those in a different video, guys. That being said, that's all I got to talk about for now. As I always say, drop a like for your boy, Goblins, and I'll be back here with more Destiny content shortly. So take it easy, guys. Have a general good, and I'll see you guys then. Peace out! Uh, the new heavy machine gun. Let's scope it out. I haven't seen the design of this quite yet, but, um, okay. It looks just like Yolder's Thunder. Um, Yolder's Thunder was the last machine gun. And the perks are... 
or sorry, the stats are pretty similar, it looks like as well. It has fairly high impact, that is a bonus to having 